This is a News 4 breaking news update. Welcome into News 4 for this breaking news on Congress's investigation of Dan Snyder, the Washington commanders, and its toxic work environment. The House Committee on Oversight and Reform just released its report saying that the NFL and the commanders covered up decades of sexual misconduct. This is a 76-page report, and it comes after months of hearings and investigations into the team's toxic culture towards its women employees. Here are the key findings of this report. Dozens of employees at the commanders were harmed by a toxic work culture for more than two decades. The team's owner, Dan Snyder, permitted and participated in this troubling conduct. Commander's leadership perpetuated a toxic workplace culture by ignoring and downplaying sexual misconduct by senior male commander's employees. The owner of the commanders, Dan Snyder, interfered with a league sanctions probe known as the Wilkinson investigation by launching a shadow investigation in the suspected sources of the Washington Post expose on the team. The committee says his was an attempt to block Ms. Wilkinson's access to information and the shadow investigation tried to silence employees who could implicate Mr. Snyder in any misconduct. In addition to failing to appear at public hearings, Mr. Snyder interfered with the committee's investigation by intimidating witnesses and blocking the production of documents. Now, the NFL was aware of serious interference with the Wilkinson investigation, according to this report, but failed to take action to stop that interference. The NFL misled the public about its handling of the Wilkinson investigation and continues to minimize workplace misconduct across the league. Obviously, there's a lot to take in here. Again, this is a 76-page report that we just got our hands on a few minutes ago. We are going through this now. We're working to get reaction from the committee, from the team, and, of course, from the NFL. And we're going to have a full report for you coming up on our website. And, of course, when we see you again this afternoon on News 4 at 4, 5, and 6 o'clock this afternoon. But once again, the House Committee on Oversight and Reform just releasing this 76-page report on the commander's toxic work environment saying that the NFL and the commanders covered up decades of sexual misconduct. I'm Erica Gonzalez.